Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. This is going to be a reading for the sign of Aries for week three of October 2019. These readings are timeless, though, so whenever you are drawn to the reading is when you may be meant to take something away from it. Doesn't have to be week three of October 2019. And if you haven't subscribed and you want to see future readings, hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell. That will notify you every time that I upload. These are for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Saturn. So if they don't resonate, don't try to make them fit. Check your birth chart. Okay. we got the Moon. The Magician. And we just had the full Moon. Yeah, yeah, this is manifestation time. Ooh, look in there. Okay, okay. I feel like our moon card is here for a couple reasons. For one, honestly, we just had the moon, full moon. It's manifesting time. Time to release some, release some stuff. And what I'm feeling, you know, also, you know, you see this path looks a little dark. But I feel like this is, you know, like seeing with clarity instead of looking through a veil so what I'm feeling is someone has been manifesting they're manifesting what they want as above so below you know think positive do positive act positive speak positive don't be negative manifest what you want in your life I feel like this is, you know, I'm be honest, I feel like this is what you don't want. Untrustworthiness, deceitfulness, distrust, just complete distrust. And I feel like this is, you know, you're manifesting, you're wanting to avoid this is what I'm feeling. Someone that's deceptive. And it, you know, if I don't feel like this is you. But I don't feel like this is who is making this offer either. Because you've got someone here that's making an offer. They're they're offering emotions. They're offering. They got you a cup of love here. I feel like you're manifesting, and, and this is not what you want. But you're being offered a cup of love from someone. There's balance. Hmm. Okay. Yes, yes, there's two people. Someone's juggling. Someone's juggling. This one is deceitful. This one, yeah. This one has love to offer. Don't juggle. There is balance, but don't juggle. You've got to make that decision. You've got to make that choice. Um, I don't feel like the choice has been made. I don't feel like, I feel like it's just between two people. It's like possibly, you know, going out with two different people and trying to make that decision. Well, which path do I want to take? Who is showing the emotion and who is seeming a bit untrustworthy? I would go with emotion. 
I feel like you're taking on this energy of the Queen of Wands, Aries. <clears throat> it's a good energy. There's growth. There's wisdom. Follow that wisdom. You see how this felt? Blow this card. Our Ace of Cups. This is emotion. This is love. Someone wants to wrap you up in a whole bunch of love. They just want to share you with it. You see all that, all that flowing? I feel like you have planted a seed. And you've been tending it. And, and you're watching it grow. You're manifesting. And you're watching it grow. And I, yeah, I feel like it's it's kind of like, well, which one? Because I feel like, you know, there's two people that you are seeing. But you manifested by, you know, planting that seed of what you want. So you need to look clear, clearly at these two individuals, and you really need to look with clarity I mean really look possibly even check up on them yeah because you've got deceit here untrustworthy and then you've got love and emotion that's about it that's what I've got so Aries I don't know you know if this doesn't resonate don't try to make it fit your life give it a thumbs up though so YouTube moves it along and just take a close look at the two individuals that you know, you are talking to or possibly seeing, maybe check into their back, their past a little bit, um, get it some insight. Yeah, that's what I got. Have an awesome day. Bye.